Yeah, the portfolio. Oh, that'd be awesome. That'd be really okay, great. Cool. I really appreciate that. Cool. Hey, thanks for meeting with me. Of course. Melissa, thank you so much, and I hope you enjoy your time in Australia. Thank you. You too. Have a good Take one. Care. Peace. Bye. Shit don't stop. Josh, get a little glimpse, man. We need this shit to be like this every single day. Some people get busy and they're like, man, damn, how am I going to handle this? I get busy and I'm like, the people at the top, they do this shit all day, every day. They don't stop and they keep it effective. So let's get in here, get this work in. It's another vlog powered by pack. We're always building, we're always growing, and we're always looking to get to the next level, keeping our standards high and making moves 365 every day of the week let's go we'll see you inside we're at john reef fitness we're about to train chest shoulders and tries this is the get back after the surgery time to keep raising the bar man i'm finally getting my strength back finally feeling good in the gym again we're gonna make sure we whoop josh up back into shape man because i can tell he's been lacking out here he ain't been he ain't been hitting it man he ain't been getting his burpees in and he he needs this workout for real so we're gonna we're gonna make sure he's feeling this one for a few days to come. We'll try to drop some business game, some business knowledge. Make sure you like the video, comment on the video. I'm picking winners every single week. Cash app prizes, free merch giveaways, all sorts of stuff. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already and share the video. Please show love, share the video. Appreciate you guys. Uh, let's get right into it. See you inside. Twenty twenty three, we're wrapping up. It's been a hell of a year. Halfway through the year, I went totally sober, ditched all the vices, no drinks, no smoking, no nothing, no nicotine, no nothing. So it's been a hell of a ride, hell of a journey. Started taking working out serious, get my old back in order, and just really the biggest shifts are changing your habits, changing your routine every single day. That's always gonna lead you to a way different result than what you were getting. Having the gym be a part of it, eating clean, waking up around the same time, you know, not going out, not partying, not getting fucked up. Really huge things, it turns out, like crazy. Crazy how far you can go in six months. So it's been a hell of a year. We're looking forward to 2024. Been training every body part twice a week, got on a program, been working with coaches, and now we're taking what's worked for me and what I've proven the results to and offering it to other people out there right now. So I'm accepting people to work one-on-one -on -one, and then we're starting a group too. That's the whole movement with Power by Pack and everything we're doing. We gotta keep this pump going right now. But yeah, we're looking forward to 2024. Change your habits, change your routine, drop the bullshit. And it's crazy how far you can go in a short amount of time. Something I've been focusing on with my lifts, especially post-surgery, is time under tension. So controlling the weight, not worrying about how much weight it is, but how much you can keep the reps going. And you know, you're looking to go 40 to 60 seconds time under tension, and then be maxed out of that. Like at your capacity, you know, straight to failure. You wanna you wanna be burned out after about 40 to 60 seconds, which if you think about it, even at a lighter weight, if you take your time and control the weight and go for the time under tension rather than how many reps you can do. I'm just seeing a lot of gain in size and strength in a short amount of time. So it's really a dope switch that I made that. And uh, a, a couple top people that really, really do their thing, that's the way they train, that's what they're explaining. So we're starting to implement more time under tension into our workouts and our daily routine. Another big game changer for me in 2023 was learning how to track my macros. Now that I know how to track my macros, I can dial in my diet, I can shed fat, lose weight in a quick amount of time with a minimal amount of effort. All you gotta do is not go over, you know, and know, know your limits, right? It's like filling up at a gas station. You need to know how much you're filling up. You don't want it overflowing onto the ground, but you also don't want to just put a little bit in there and not have any gas in the tank, you know what I'm saying? So you got to know your macros. Those have been major game changers for me in 2023. There's some cool apps that you can use to do it really easily. We hook all that up in the program that we offer now, Power by Pack, with a custom training app. We dial that in with a couple other complimentary apps that uh, are going to allow you dial your macros in, know what to work out every day, know how much to do. Everything's laid out for you. That's the benefit of getting with a coach, getting on a program, 
and not just leaving it all to chance or to guess. So 2024, we're dialing it in even more. We're going to the next level. We're gonna keep progressing. We're gonna keep this thing going. When I stopped and dropped all the vices, I knew I was dropping alcohol and that all of that other stuff for a long time. I didn't know when I would pick smoke back up or if I would, but we're gonna keep the shit going. It's gone six months. I wanna keep it going into 2024. Don't wait till 2024 to start. It ain't even the new year yet. We're already planning. We're already executing, making this shit happen as we go. So let's keep getting this pumping. Hit for my wings. I need my hands. This life is real. Don't they pretend. Came off the fence. I get it in. I get it in. I get it in. Hit for my wings. I need my hands. This life is real. Can't play pretend. Came off the fence. I get it in. I get it in. I get it in. I'm on my job, I get it done, but you should know that. Shine like a son of 101, you should know that. I get the front and in the back, you should know that. The biggest thing getting in shape done for me is boosting my mental attitude, my patience, my clarity, and just my confidence. Because when you show up every day for yourself and do what you say you're going to do, you say it to yourself. When you do it and keep your promise to yourself, life changes fast, for real. Your confidence is gonna go through the roof. Your belief in yourself goes through the roof. And belief is the second step of a three-part process. First you visualize it, you see it, then you believe it. You gotta believe it can happen, then you can achieve it. So until you believe it, you'll never be able to do whatever it is you're wanting to do. A lot of people don't believe in themselves a lot of people don't keep the promises they make to themselves. Therefore, they're never gonna achieve too much. It just doesn't work out. The universe isn't that crazy to where it rewards people that don't do the work and don't believe in themselves. So you gotta show up, you gotta believe in yourself, then you're gonna get to whatever it is that you're setting out to do. So 2023, the big turn up for me was showing up for myself, getting in this gym, getting this working every single day, keeping that promise to myself, and now I'm making more money, making more moves, and got a lot more going on than I'm able to do. I'm at Club John Reed, it's only 6 p.m., let's go! Get for my wings, I need my hands. This life is real, if they pretend. Came off the fence, I get it in, I get it in, I get it in. Hit for my wings, I need my hands. This life is real, if they pretend. Came off the fence, I get it in, I get it in, I get it in. Motherfucker. Probably need to go into the other room. My baby, so I hit them on the FaceTime. I need it all for them, so no, I cannot waste time. Facing these oceans, feel the water on my waistline. We trust the process, and I only know it takes time. You can get it, got no worries, I'm gonna make mine. Going global, I'ma get it out the state lines. Paying taxes at a mortar, which you may not. Different bracket, eating off a different plate. Now. Hit for my wings, I need my hands. This life is real, if they pretend. Came What do you think about the shake? Smoothie. Should have put a vanilla <laughs> instead of Fuck, dude. Present. Shits are so mid. Yeah. Look, if Marlon's gonna change one thing about John Reed, turn the fucking music down just a little bit. And you need to get your shakes on point. I mean, what are these baby smoothies, dude? This is like a 10 ounce, you know? And then on top of that, I gotta make sure they put ice in it. And half the time it tastes like shit. It's like, damn, how are you gonna fuck up a smoothie? I can make a hundred different smoothies and that shit's gonna be still tasting good, but you know, it is what it is. We gotta do what we gotta do. We haven't ate all day. Need to get in some calories. Definitely important to take in some protein within 30 to 40 minutes of your workout so that your muscles and body can absorb it quickly. You gotta feed your muscles. After you break them down like that, you gotta give them something. It's better to do real food, obviously, but you can supplement, you know, at times too. So yeah, get that protein in, major key find a good smoothie spot because John Reed, cool to come work out, but the smoothies makes me wanna chuck this shit right here. I'm gonna drink it anyways though.